one to avenge them. Me! Me! I'm going to defeat you! Um, hello, uh, fucking, hey Ronan. Yeah. We're, we're, uh, you've, we've been dormant for thousands of years. Mm. But we have arisen to the, to the sound of the bells tolling that Devil All May right. Cry, Devil, Devil May Cry 5's, uh, special edition is coming to the PS5. For that very reason, I've pre-ordered a PS5. How about you, Ronan? Uh, you have pre-ordered a PS5. <laughs> great, good great yep <laughs> um i so yeah so fucking as hype for that i was like ronan we're gonna start playing some devil may cry games and then i gave you the option of to start with any of the five and you are choosing three right yep all right we well, go ahead and start at three right there uh yeah and here we fucking go so three is a good choice because it's it's a uh, the most popular and also like um it's the first one that happens like in the timeline it's like mm -hmm. a prequel so this will be an optimal experience sweet dreams <laughs> you've heard of it haven't you right off the bat the all the scenery is important when oh, okay I was young, my father would tell me stories about it long ago in ancient times a demon rebelled against his own kind for the sake of the human race with his sword he shut the portal to the demonic realm and sealed the evil entities off from our human world but since he was a demon himself his power was also trapped on the other side i never believed it I thought it was just a child's fairy tale. But I discovered that this so-called legend wasn't a myth at all. Can you hear okay? Sparta yeah. existed. Sparta, and she says. Well, I met the sons of Sparta. Both of them. Though the same blood of their father flowed through their veins. Are you comprehending what's happening? Each other fiercely like our enemies. Sorta. They're fighting so fast that they just made a dome of cutting all the raindrops. It seemed as if they derived some sort of twisted pleasure from this brotherly fighting. Is it? <laughs> Want to know the name? Devil May Cry. So how, how's that shit? How do you feel? <laughs> it's uh, it's cool. Cool. So okay, I'm gonna give you a couple more options here with with all of the games that we play. Um, I'll let you either choose to load game and use all of the skills right off the bat because then you can learn the whole optimal move set faster, or you can go with a new game so that you can learn as you go. It's totally up to you. Do not turn turbo on, that will <laughs> that will fuck you up. <laughs> that, will, that makes the entire game run at 1.2 times speed. I see. And it's fucking, it's it's the hard, it's for real men. <laughs> She's gonna fuck with my brightness, all right, go for it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, um, uh, your choice. Okay, good. No, so, gold or yellow? Yeah, so, uh, <laughs> this is this is actually quite a complicated option. So what it means is, gold is when you die, um, you can collect these gold orbs that are pretty much like one ups. Uh, gold is when you die, you can use one of them to instantly revive where you are. Uh, yellow is uh, when you die, you just restart from the checkpoint, but you can do that unlimited times. Okay. 
So like with the gold one, mm -hmm. how does that work? So with gold, you use a gold orb, which you only have a finite amount of, and you collect throughout the world. And when, mm -hmm. you, when you die, you revive right on the spot. With yellow, you just revive from the checkpoint instead of uh, restarting the whole mission. But you don't have to collect any yellow orbs, you just do that infinitely. I feel like I want yellow. Yeah, it is, it is the easier option for beginners. Alright, so... This is your uh, main mission select screen, so you've chosen... Why do I have easy and normal? Uh, well, this is kind of the special edition, just lets you swap between difficulties in, in, at any time, so... I see. Start at normal mission one, here we go. Here's the exact same opening again, you can go ahead and skip that. <laughs> All right, the phone. Remember that? Mm. This is a year after that opening scene. I'm gonna eat some Captain Crunch. Oops, all berries. All right, while you're playing this. Sorry, not open for business yet. I haven't even picked a name for this joint. And so yeah, get ready for a bunch of ridiculous awesome shit <laughs> that he does. Like, you're not gonna fucking even comprehend half the stuff he, he can do. Well, if you want to use the bathroom, help yourself. The toilet's in the back. Is your name Dante, son of Sparta? Where did you hear that? From your brother. He sent this invitation for you. Please, accept it. I would like to make it known to you that the community's uh, pet name for Dante is Wacky Woohoo Pizza Man. <laughs> And I'm not joking. <laughs> Invitation, huh? I'll take a slice <laughs> and eat it. So durability check. Peaks of durability. Get stabbed by like five demons. Don't even feel it. Um, if I could hazard a guess and date myself, I would say that Dante, right at the beginning of 3 right now, mm. um, is about perfect cell. Okay. So that's where we fucking start. And that number will go up. This party's getting crazy. Let's rock. Ah, it's fucking jukebox. Oh, god damn it. There you go. Alright, get ready to play the game running. Actually, <laughs> wait, not yet. He's gonna do some more cool shit. I forgot. <laughs> he's got a blade stuck through his arm and he's using it instead of his sword. Can you believe the amount of asinine shit happening right now? <laughs> you can actually do this in-game. Like, everything you see, you can actually do. Okay, here's some- here's some shit. Here's the famous- his bullets are fucking ridiculous. <laughs> Here is gameplay. Um, okay, so this is only this starts in three. So this is in three, four, and five. This is a thing. If okay. we play one and two, you don't have to worry about this. But you can choose one of your four styles. So what this does is it'll change your B button. You know your well on PlayStation, I guess it's circle button. So triangle is your regular attack. Okay. Okay. Square is gun, shoot bullet. Mm -hmm. um, X is jump. And circle is your style. Whichever style you choose will change this button. Trickster is kind of the the middle of the road 
uh, if you're kind of getting experience with Devil May Cry, you might start to go with Trickster. It's kind of like the dodge. You'll you'll have infinite like mobility and getting around and teleportation and stuff like that. Okay. Swordmaster is the DPS. It's kind of like it's what Scrub Lords always ch choose, but like for good reason. Like it's it's good. Mm. Um, Gunslinger is the bad one. Don't use that. And then Royal Guard is the the Chad fucking learn how to fucking parry you fucking casual. And Royal what Guard, is it? Royal Guard. So it ch changes your circle button into a guard, and it's uh, frame one. And if you guard things um, within five frames, you'll earn meter towards a Royal Guard meter that you'll have. Mm -hmm. And if, if it's frame one, you'll earn two meters, and it also do damage back to the enemy. And w with that meter, you can spend it by pressing forward and guard when you get hit to do a parry and the more meter you have the more damage it does and if you have a full meter it is actually the strongest attack in the game hmm. so royal guard is <clears throat> like objectively the best one but also the hardest one to use sword master is the easiest and also like pretty good trickster is the most versatile and gunslinger is like eh, <sighs> wait till you have everything all the good guns in the game to use that one you can change over time like you can switch between them between missions and stuff and uh, the, the more you use one, it'll level up to like level three. You'll get new stuff without having to pay money. Did you choose Swordmaster? I haven't chosen yet. This no. is just tutorial. Oh, okay. I thought I gave you an option. <clears throat> no. Nah. All right. So yeah, Swordmaster is level one. Your your special is going to be he'll spin his sword in a big circle, mm. and it, it launches enemies and stuff, and it's pretty good change between missions these statues are where you change your styles and uh, you know upgrade yourself so here we go you can go ahead and hit customize first and see what we have style you can choose here we have trickster equipped right now you can switch to whatever you want I want sword sure all right and then uh, nothing equipped yet uh, you can go ahead and go to item how many we don't have any orbs so red orbs are your money uh, mm. yellow yellow orbs are your revives and then blue orbs um, are like heart pieces like you get four and your health levels up okay and then purple orbs are things you'll find out later and that's about it um, I don't remember what action oh action is your move set and then equip is your weapons so yeah so rebellion is your sword you can buy these when you get money stinger is your close in attack uh, air hike is your double jump and there's a third thing I didn't read but don't worry about it <laughs> uh, oh yeah drive that's like um, you shoot a sword beam and it's pretty cool mm. there's a lot of damage guns, guns and you know start with ebony and ivory they, these were made by um, a famous gunsmith named fucking god I don't even remember like Ira or something like that mm. in, a, in a city called Redgrave and this is all lore you'll find out in two alright all right, so now you can go ahead and start. You have Sword Master equipped. So triangle, here's all your buttons. So the taunt button is actually important. When you taunt, it'll enrage enemies to attack you, and that's useful mm. for, like, Royal Guard. And uh, you'll also get style up. You know the style system, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, so your style rank will go up an entire rank whenever you taunt an enemy. Okay. Okay, go for it. So, uh, okay, I'm hold, hold R1 to target a thing. That'll make, see. You, that'll make you walk slow, so if you ever want to move fast, it's like Dark Souls, you should let go of lock-on. I'm seeing. Yep. I'm learning. Mm-hmm. Guns? Just, yep. So you have regular, you have a regular triangle combo that's four hits, and then you have, a, you have pause combos. So like, you have a hit one, pause, and then continue. There's your money. Actually, you start with a three-hit combo, not a four-hit combo, so... Yeah, here you go. <laughs> Uh, slight pause, why in midair? Mm -hmm. Yep. So if you're firing guns in the air, it'll help stall you in the air. So if an enemy is like doing an attack and you don't want to land in it, you start shooting. Yep. Try your uh, pause combo. Hit Y and then pause and then. Oh, there's your style button. That combos twice if you press that. There's your pause combo right there. You can do a third hit on there. There's your air slam. 
Um, also unique with Swordmaster. While well, well, you have Swordmaster, there's green orbs, their health. Um, while well, you have Swordmaster equipped, if you press the side button in the air, you'll be able to do a unique air combo instead of just the slam. So like, go up to that guy, hit circle, and then jump and start spamming circle. Wait, yeah, hit circle it. afterwards. Yeah, keep hitting circle. Because your triangle is just a, a ground slam, and yeah, there you go. Swordmaster gives you an air combo. And you can see on the uh, when you target them, the, the the white claws around them, that's their health. See that? See his health going down? Uh, the white claws but, yeah, on no, them? Yeah, he's got like one little white on the top. Now he's dead. Mm. Yeah. If you want to um, not fuck with lock-on too much, you can click the left sk stick to change without having to like let go and retarget. Yeah, see, see their, see how their health works on the, on the target. Yeah, I think so. Uh, what a wee babby doing baby's first combos. <laughs> There you go, there you go. You can do a third one there. On that on that pause combo. So with the pause combo, yeah, there you go. The the little moment where he kinda brings the sword back up for a slight second, that's when you wanna start the, the pause combo. Yep, right there. And then there's a third hit there, there you go. And um on the third hit of that pause combo, if you just start spamming instead of just doing the third hit, you'll do like a, a fast stinger move. It's like one and then pause and then do the pause combo and then just start spamming it. The pause a little bit longer. Yep, yep, and then spam right after that hit. Unless you have to unlock it, I don't remember. You might have to unlock it. Try launch and launch jump and then style. Do an air combo. We get there when we get there. We get there. We get there. We get there. So you chose normal mode, right? Yeah. All right. Well, the next mission I'll tell you is a vibe check, a skill check, if as it were. Let go of the pizza. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to eat cereal over here, man. You could just be making pizza references. Now you get your cool red jacket that Dante's always known for. Looks like this is gonna be one hell of a party. So that's mission one. So here's how our uh, ranking system works. You're timed, how many orbs you collect, how, um, how much you kept a high combo, the amount of damage you did, and how many items you used. Um, so with items being used and everything, you can like buy green stars and stuff to like refill your health and everything. Mm -hmm. uh, the fucking best advice I can give you is to just fucking don't. Mm. Like just treat this more like a Dark Souls game. Like um, if you die, just restart and don't, don't fuck with items. Because you get way less score and it's like, robs you of learning how to fight the enemies. Are you going with Royal Guard? Yeah. Good choice.